How's it going, Kitanning? Another beautiful day in the greatest city in the world. Got the flowers just starting to bloom. Got the trees starting to bud. It's gonna be really beautiful here in a few weeks. take you down to the building give you an update uh, connections has been working on their space and uh, I think I think they're getting pretty close to being done I want to go see it myself so uh, but first I want to show you a couple months ago we started working on it and uh, give you a couple minutes of that footage right now got a little uh, downtown contending work day happening here we're working on the uh, connections building which is one of the ones that I bought a while ago we are cleaning it out so uh, getting all the old desks out starting to work on the inside. Hopefully this will be a open operating office here within the next uh, month or two, but uh, I'll show you what's going on. Got a very robust desk, probably several hundred pounds. Some new carpet for the stairs. Just beginning to clean everything out here. We're coming along pretty good here. Almost got the sidewalk filled up here. <laughs> got all the old carpet out. New carpet coming soon. This is actually gonna be a floating floor in here though. So getting it cleaned up. Last uh, little steps here for today. Okay, we are at the end of the day for now. Let me show you what we did. So uh, this room's all cleared out, basically prepped for flooring. Several more things that we need to do. There's some uh, lights that we, some electrical stuff that we gotta figure out. There's a minor plumbing repair to do and then uh, this room is like you know a big kitchen area this was like the fellowship hall for the former church that was here so there's just a couple little pieces of damage in here for a future work day see up here there's some water damage so we get to take out all those tiles and replace them a couple floor tiles over here that we'll probably do something with so that's where we were then uh, let's see how it looks right now Wow. So looks like the floor just got finished today. It was about halfway done this morning when I came and took a look at it, but man, the floor looks really great. We gotta put the trim back up now. Uh, I love the paint colors as well. It's looking fresh. And then here's the back. Looking pretty great as well. Overall, I mean, obviously there's just some general cleanup stuff that has to be done, but uh, it's looking really, really good. It's gonna be a nice little space here when it's finished. I'm excited to see what I'll end up using this space for. I know they have bigger plans than it just being an office space. We've had talks of events with some, you know, music, food, and games, and uh, different things like that, on top of, obviously, their core mission of just helping people and getting them connected with local nonprofits and to all the different places that, that people might need along their journey. I'm on my way to the church, we're getting some estimates on some work to be done there. Here at the church, we're uh, preparing for the future where we're gonna need to replace our roofs. We're not, we're not in like an emergency situation right now, but it's quite a big job and we know that it's gonna need done within the next couple years. We have a shingles and then we have several huge flat roofs. We're in the middle of fundraising now. Hopefully we'll do the flat roofs this year, maybe the shingles next. It's been awesome to see how this uh, building has become really a community hub over the past couple years since we've owned it. It's pretty exciting to see. And so we wanna make sure that it's uh, well taken care of and that it remains a community hub for a long time into the future. The problem of course is that we don't have the money to do all of that right at this moment. Uh, but we have some of it and uh, we're gonna probably have some fundraisers coming up for uh, to try to get some more. So if you wanna get involved with any of that, you can stay updated on this channel and uh, you can donate if you want to. We'll put the link for the church in the description. <laughs> We'd be more than happy to have your help and you can just uh, put a memo in there that you want it to go towards the roof. Stop at the garden while I'm here. We were here Saturday, started putting down new compost and some new mulch. We got all of our onions planted as well. You can see them starting to grow but then saturday evening we had a huge storm uh, they were saying 60 to 70 mile an hour winds which is obviously far more uh, than we're used to here and we used to have a greenhouse that was right here <laughs> we just moved it down here just a few weeks ago and it's uh it's completely destroyed very sad i don't i don't think it can be saved 
Got our tarps doing a lot of work too. This one got blown away. I need to uh, reset that real quick. That'll be good for now. So if you wanna help in the garden, we got a lot to do there. Uh, it's gonna be, you know, a lot of prep work. We wanna get all of our fresh compost spread to get our, our fertility for the year. We started with basically no fertility on that property when we first uh, dug the soil. There was like a eight sixteenth of an inch maybe of soil on top. So we've added a lot of fertility there. Uh, last year we added 60 yards of compost and this year we got another 30 yards. So, And I think that'll probably be, probably be it. Our plan is that we would like to be creating most of our own compost and creating most of our own fertility. So in the future, if we got compost, it'd just be a little bit. So this will be like kind of the last establishing year for the garden and then it'll just be maintaining and adding little things here and there but uh, we could really use your help there's a lot of labor to do uh, so if you want to do that we could set you up during the day or you can help us on the weekends whatever you want to do just let me know in the comments or get a hold of me on Facebook or Instagram or wherever whatever's most convenient for you we'd love to hear from you and get you involved got one last uh, bit of news to report for you meter maid alive and well I just wanted you all to know <laughs> she's doing good she's doing really good great a job